How to have a dynamic page on your iPhone. iOS as an operating system has the idea of keeping all applications on the home screen. Progress is the app library, but it's still technically the home screen. However, what if I tell you that you can have a dynamic page on which the content will change depending on the use of applications? If you want to find out how, stay until the end. First of all, I will show you what it looks like for me. It's this page. It looks like any other normal iPhone page. However, this is all a widget. It's a Siri suggester. How can you do this? So hold on an empty place on the entire screen until the plus icon appears in the upper right corner. After that, go to a blank page. Tap on the plus now. A window will open where you can choose widgets. We're going to search for a widget called Siri Suggester. Once you find it and click on it, all you have to do is tap the Add Widget button and it will appear on your home screen. As you can see, there is space for two more widgets like this. So if you want to achieve the effect of the whole page like I did, add two more. It is important to note that the applications will change automatically. If you do not want an application to be displayed, simply hold your finger on it and in the menu that will appear, tap on the Don't Suggest option. After that, just confirm the selection by tapping on the button of the same name and the application will no longer be displayed as suggested. That's all for this video. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more iOS tips, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update from us. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.